Welcome to this brief introduction to the Open Accounts Connector for Microsoft Dynamics CRM. If you're using both Dynamics CRM and Open Accounts in your organization, you'll be aware that with Dynamics CRM you're probably tracking your sales, contact management, marketing or customer service operations. And obviously on the finance side of things, you're tracking different information. Historically, these have been two siloed areas. You can now bring the two together and that's going to help to provide a more complete client picture. It will also empower your account managers with more information. It will provide consistency across the front and back office operations. It will also provide actionable insight, particularly through dashboards and workflow automation. You can also improve coordination across your sales and finance departments, and that can also help with cash flow through better visibility of client data days. So let's look at some of the specifics of the flow of data across the two solutions. So from Dynamic CRM to Open Accounts, we'll be tracking companies, name, currency, address details, primary contact name, and other address information. From Open Accounts to Dynamic CRM, we'll be taking the name, credit status, account balance, and other items as highlighted on this slide. An important thing to note here is that the flow of data and the items being synchronized can be tailored to your unique requirements. So whatever specific requirements you have for tracking information in one system or the other, we can accommodate that using this connector as the basis. So let's go ahead and take a look at the details of this connector. OK, let's begin the overview here in Open Accounts. And in this view, you've got a fairly familiar list of existing customers. On the Microsoft Dynamics CRM side of things, you'll be tracking your sales or service or marketing information. And at the heart of this will be organizations or contacts. So here we're looking at a list of customers and prospects. And if you're familiar with the CRM side of things, typically uh, you will be moving organizations through the prospect phase and then on to become a customer. The question then is whether or not you want to push those customers into the Open Account system. So here we've got three organizations, AdventureWorks, Alpine Ski and Blue Yonder, and we're going to move those now into the Open Account system using the connector. Obviously the movement of that data happens automatically in the background and you can set this to happen on a frequency that suits your needs. This could be on a batch basis or near real time if you need that. So the information coming across from Dynamic CRM will take in the company, name, currencies, basic address information and importantly when it lands in open accounts it will be allocated a customer number and this is the item that keeps the two records synchronized on an ongoing basis. So next we'll take a look at the open account system now containing the Microsoft CRM data and then we'll go back to Dynamic CRM and see how the information pulled in from open accounts is appearing in that system. So here we are back in Open Accounts and straight away we can see there are the three records from the CRM system, AdventureWorks, Blue Yonder and Alpine Ski. Let's open up the record for AdventureWorks and take a look at some of the detail that's been pulled across. And here we can see it's been allocated a specific uh, uh, customer number, uh, we've obviously got the name of the organization and we've pulled across the address information, uh, the contact information and so forth. So we can see here how the dynamic CRM information is now appearing directly as a customer record in open accounts. Obviously there are a number of accounts that uh, uh, reside normally in uh, open accounts here and we're going to now go and take a look at those as they would appear in Dynamics CRM. So back in Dynamics CRM we can see we have a record from open accounts that's uh, now visible in the system. We've got the account number that's keeping it synchronized and we've got some core uh, details be it turnover or debtor information that's available on that specific record. We can also go and take a look at a list of records that are appearing specifically from open accounts and we can navigate through those and we've got some predefined headings here that are showing us the debtor days and so forth. So I can look at specific uh, records from open accounts on a, on a general kind of view here but I can also go and drill into specific data information inside the dynamic CRM system and I can also sort information uh, by uh, clicking on these headings if I need to do that I can also look at turnover information so here I've got a list of uh, all the accounts with the information fed through from open accounts and here I can see turnover year-to-date 
What I can also use because I'm now in Dynamic CRM is the charting facility. So I've got a very useful chart here that's showing me the top five accounts by turnover. And this is very useful visualization of information that can help guide and direct your account management activities that are going on in the Dynamic CRM solution. What you're also able to do is work with dashboards and we've set up a number of dashboards that again you can further configure if you choose to that will highlight key information that's important for people to understand in the front office. So again here we've got some key data information with all the detail uh, beneath that. And equally, if we just wanted to understand uh, turnover, just as we were looking at a specific chart earlier, we could perhaps uh, have some dashboard views showing us some key uh, information based on accounts by turnover, turnover year to date, or turnover this period, with some nice charts that are available there. And with all of these dashboards in Dynamic CRM, you're able to drill into the detail behind those. That's obviously just a standard feature in the system. So here we have a completely coordinated, synchronized uh, setup between the two solutions, providing far better insight for account managers and far better information for uh, people using open accounts as well. OK, that concludes this brief introduction to the Open Accounts Connector for Microsoft Dynamics CRM. Just a quick reminder of some of the key benefits. It provides a more complete client picture, empowering your account managers with more information. It will provide consistency across your front and back office operations, providing actionable insight through dashboards and workflow automation. It will improve coordination across your sales and finance departments, and even help with cash flow through better visibility of client data days. The solution can obviously be tailored to your specific needs and that's important to remember. So if you do have any questions, do contact your advanced account manager or get in touch directly with Consult CRM.